Hello, how y'all doing today? Um, I thought this would be a very good topic to do. And this is basically um, share tips and share uh, spiritual ideas with your children. Um, I say this because a lot of the times parents, you know, we put ourselves in, on a pedestal, which I don't. But parents have put themselves on a pedestal and, you know what I'm saying, um, basically made it look like to their kids that they never had any struggles and they never had any trouble or anything. So when our, when the kids see the parents and they they grow up or whatever and they in them same situations, they don't know how to handle those situations because they were spoon-fed or, or they were rocked to sleep the whole time. But I feel like we do have to be more honest with our children. We got to let them know that it's a vicious world out here. We have to know, let them know uh, spirituality. We have to let them know who God is. We have to let them know um, that the devil is out here, um, you know, like a, 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 a lion seeking someone to devour at any time. You know, you got to teach your children how to be able to cope. You got to talk to your children regularly and make sure everything, you know what I'm saying, is off their mind. They got a clear conscience. They ain't dealing with nothing. Nobody's harassing them. Nobody's bullying them. Nobody's belittling them. You know, we also got to let our children know, uh, um, not, not this, we don't need to let our children see us down, but we do need to let them know that everything's not going to be all peachy. So, whenever it's not all peachy for them, they know that it's normal. See, if they see us walking around with, with fake smiles all the time and, you know, not breaking breaking life down, when they finally do start walking in life, they're not going to know how to take it. Uh, to be honest with you, for a long time, I was, I was real gullible. Uh, I came from a, a good middle-class family, and uh, they taught me good morals, but I didn't know... I didn't know the bad side of it. So whenever I finally did go out there, I was sucked in. So now I educate my children. And I share with them what I have learned. And um, it's going to help them a lot. Just like my son, I could tell that it's helping him. He doesn't even want to really hang with his homeboys. He think he think I'm his homie. And, um, and I'm honored for him to feel that way. Me and him talk. We talk about God. You know, um, I help him with anything he needs to, and he understand who God God is. You know, and he separates himself from foolery. Um, I didn't start learning up those things that my son my son is about ten years ahead of where I was at. When I was thirteen, I was not behaving like my son. You know, I was um, um, I was not behaving like him at all. But we have to share that spiritual stuff with our children. You know. Even my seven-year-old and my ten-year-old, they know who God is. Um, you know, they they just they just know. They know more than the average child. They know what to stay away from. Um, um, I teach them about God as well. Um, you know, I don't I don't I don't try to really sugarcoat things for them too much, and and I try not to put them too grown either. So I try to figure out. A normal balance and a, and a good balance for my children to have so they'd be able to survive out here in the world but you have to keep that open line of communication with your children don't never let them feel like they're alone you know because we are the backbone in our children but i just want to tell y'all that you know um sometimes we get caught up in working we get caught up in life and uh we just got to make sure we asking our children on a daily basis are you okay how you feeling? Sowing them good seeds into them too. So I appreciate y'all for viewing. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. But we have to show uh, children survival techniques, survival uh, tips. You know what I'm saying? Because there is a lot of suicide out here. There is a lot of obesity out here. There is a lot of depression out here. So, you know, we got to check on our children. Appreciate you for viewing.